Welcome back, everybody. We're back at it again this week with another unboxing. I'm Patrick Dempsey, uh, Instagram at SneakerGrandpa, online SneakerGrandpa.com. Please go check those out. I also have here with me today my expert panel, OG influencers who always have interesting opinions on these shoes, and we're going to find out what they think of what this is today. But first, let me have them introduce themselves. Vivi? Hi, I'm Vivi. Which is how long? Six years. All right, Georgia? Hi, my name is Georgia, and I'm six years old, and I've been into sneakers for about six years. Six years, okay. So one interesting thing I've noticed recently is that we seem to have started a trend with people doing unboxing videos on YouTube. So we really started that whole thing, and now we've got other people doing it. And also, I see some of them... Some of the uh, YouTube celebrities out there who have been enjoying this for a while now have decided to completely get rid of their collections. What do y'all think about that? What if we sold all the sneakers right now? What would y'all think about that? And we had no more sneakers. We could get a new dining room table. <laughs> a new dining room table? Georgia, what do you think? What if we just went upstairs and in the closet in there and gathered everything up and put it all up for sale? You wouldn't be able to get any earrings in my dream. I would give way. all the money to mom and she would buy all of my clothes. <laughs> oh, okay. Buy our clothes. All right. Well, I just thought that was interesting. See what you all think about that. But what do we have this week? Uh, what do you think it a is? A white tape box. White tape? Anybody Adidas. remember what that white? I think it's Adidas. Adidas, you think? Or Brooks. I don't know. Adidas or Brooks. Something Adidas, that has Brooks, Vans, Vans, or Reebok. Or Ultra Boost. Or Ultra Boost. Or Ultra Boost. I don't think anybody has gotten it yet. Nike. Nike. Oh, Nike. Nike. We've been getting a lot of Nike stuff. Yeah. It's a little bit nicer. Yeah. Box. Yeah. Paniculus. Pinnacle. Yeah. There's a box right there. Nine point five. I can see five. size nine and a half. Oh my god. What do you think that is? It is definitely the nicer box than the standard. It's got the glossy Nike logo on there. And uh, it's the slide box instead of just the pop-over box. So that's a little bit nicer, but let's see what we got in here. I wear a four point five. I don't, I either wear a 13 or, or a 12. They'll fit me in about, oh my gosh. Four years. I like them. You like them? Yeah. Yeah. It's the Air Max 1 Pinnacle. This colorway is actually, let's see, iced jade, dark atomic teal, jade, glaze, pestle, atomic, something or other. Pretty much it's. <laughs> Shades of green and blue is yeah. what it is. They can call them all they want, but it's different shades of gray, of and greens and blues. And um, party colors. So this is the Nike Lab and the Pinnacle release, which means it tends, it's marketed and tends to be a little bit nicer than the regular releases of Air Max One. So those are uh, both primaries. Though. And from first look, it actually really is uh, nice leather on the toe box uh, and on the sides here. All one color midsole and outsole. Here, tell me what you think. This has more of a box toe. Not really a round toe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, it's a little bit better. That's one of the things that they're supposed to be promoting is that the toe box Stinky. is supposed to be a little bit boxy. less boxy than the others. And I think compared to some of the older releases, it actually is. I still don't think it's completely there, but it's definitely much better than it was. Uh, looks like just one pair of laces in there. Well done. A nice oh pair. Gosh. Oh my gosh, you're putting the size of my, half of my arm. <laughs> <laughs> what do y'all think? Good stuff? Yeah. You like the color? But very stinky, and that stinkiness is gay. 
it is stinky. Head it was the same way with the the Air Jordan Royals. Let me oh, see. very, very chemically. And it also gave me a headache. Did it give you a headache? Those. Oh, very chemically smelling. Yes, it that is. chemically smelling gave me a headache. Oh. Yes, it is. <laughs> what, what do we think of this pair this week, girls? I yay think or nay? Twenty. Twenty. Yay. Vivi, you like them? Yeah. You think it's something I can I probably wear yeah. more yay. often? And they're kind of dressy too. Yeah, they almost nice. are. They're darker colors, subtle. Not all the same color, but you know, different. They're kind of like. It's kind of the colors. Um, they're kind of like army colors, you know. Yeah. Like yeah. the all the like the army colors on you. Well, almost all the army colors on. On your gnome that we painted. Yeah. Over Not there, just a little what? more subtle than that, a little more laid back, but definitely the materials are premium. I can see the shape. It's try it's trying to get there. I don't see a whole lot of I don't see really see any glue stains or anything else like that. I think quality wise it's you know, probably lives up. Even the leather lining uh, around the collar here is probably lives up to the Nike Lab Pinnacle name. But uh, yeah, happy with them. I probably think be getting these to wear because Also, yeah, because they've cold. been in the sun a lot. Yeah, too that hot. might have done it too. Okay, well, that's. I think that's about it for this week. Glad you guys like these. I'm definitely happy with them. But very we'll short. Video. Probably wear these. Do you want to keep going a little longer? <laughs> do, do we need to talk some more and let you just have the floor? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's it for this week. Thank you again for watching. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe, like, and Georgia. Comment down below if you like this video. Bye. Bye.